All right, I'm going to show you guys how I converted my Mercury 99. Here we are. It's a 2009 Mercury 99. And how I converted that to run on propane. So, uh, let me if you can get the shot of the front. So, this black line, go back a little bit more. So, here's my propane tank, proof that it's run on propane. Uh, black line goes in to the regulator right on top. So, this is the regulator, it's a beam T60. And then uh, the red hose is the output. So, and that output goes all the way over here. You follow me? Um, so up on top, so there's an idle screw adjustment that will adjust your richness. The idle screws on the front of the regulator. Uh, but then that goes in uh, to this uh, plate here that bolts right up to your carburetor. I got both of these components from Carbon Turbo Systems in Shakopee, Minnesota. Uh, so in this plate, there's a uh, like a slit where the propane comes in. So really, there's no other modifications other than that. Uh, the fuel line's been disconnected from the carburetor uh, and tied off. So that was the fuel line there before. So if uh, everything's tuned correctly, this should pull. This should start to pulse. So let's get there. So there's no priming necessary with this. Just turn the motor on, open the gas, and turn the throttle to wide open. And I guess it's just one pull. So you see there's like no warm-up time needed. And it fires right off. Uh, you don't have to choke anything. The choke is basically on, doesn't operate and disconnected. Uh, idle's great, you can run it right in the garage, you don't need any smoke. Uh, really no maintenance. Your carburetor is won't get gummed up. Spark plugs won't foul. If I pulled my, pl my plugs right now, they would be look like it, I just put them in. But throttle response is really good. That was down really nice. So uh, again, those carbon turbo systems hooked me up with this. Um, Restrict plate, hose, and a uh, regulator. It was about $180 for the whole setup. Uh, but yeah, shouldn't need any maintenance. That's it.